hydrochloric acid is a strong acid, hydrobromochloric and sulfuric, two, perchloric nitric and iodic. Yes, that's the one that's nice high. My teacher says that acids can be strong or weak. It has to do with whether they break apart. You would think that the ones that held together would be the strong ones. They're not. But don't they? Oh, what the? Ooh, 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 ooh. I need to learn the differences. Ooh, 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 ooh. Which ones are strong or weak? Oh, strong acids never, ever, ever go back together. Strong acids never, ever, ever go back together. The ratios normally one to one for stoichiometry. Yeah, strong acids never, ever, ever, ever go back together like, like ever. ever. Weak acids have an equilibrium constant. It's like that because they don't completely break apart. But why the heck are acids called weak when they're the ones that hold together stronger than the other ones? Ooh, 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 ooh. Why are they weak and not strong ooh, 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 ooh. when they don't break apart? But the strong acids never, ever, ever go back together. Strong acids never, ever, ever go back together. When strong acids hit the water, they dissociate. Yeah, strong acids never, ever, ever, ever Go back together. Oh, oh. Why do the weak acids not break? Oh, wait, yes, they do. Just solve for K. So, like, I was trying to find the K of a strong acid, but when I put the concentration of the acid on the bottom, it was zero, in case not defined, like ever. Oh, strong acids never, ever, ever go back together. Strong acids never, ever, ever go back together. When you try to solve for K, it's at infinity. Yeah, strong acids never, ever, ever, ever go back together.